Hey, what's going on guys? Gears of Scorch here, and I just thought I'd bring you a quick video on the information that's been released overnight about Dead by Daylight. So if you're a console user like myself, and you're looking forward to the Lullaby of the Dark DLC, or the Halloween Michael Myers DLC, that's coming out soon with no date, well, we now have a date. So we only have the PS4 release dates currently, but if you're in North America, you can expect the Lullaby for the Dark to come out on August 21st. And for those waiting on the Halloween Michael Myers DLC, that's going to be coming on August the 25th. Now they did state that the PS4, Europe and Xbox One versions of the game are still waiting on the confirmation of the dates. So you can safely assume it will be on or around that time. It's very unusual that they release DLC on different dates across regions. So it should all be on the same date. Obviously the PC version already has that. So let's move on to the next bit of news. Right, so they've put here that players who are using the exploit on the Crotus Pren Asylum will be banned. So if you're using that exploit, please stop. They go on to say on the Steam page, uh, basically just get a recording of the video and send it straight in um, with their Steam ID. And that's pretty bad news for people who've been using that exploit. So stop while you're ahead. Right, moving on. Now, this is really interesting. They've released a roadmap of what they expect to happen with the console updates moving forward. So we've got the Little Boy for the Dark, we've got the Halloween DLC coming, they're both coming obviously, and we've got the Charity Case DLC still to come, and then catching up to the PC build. Quite interesting, the Huntress Lullaby chapter will be 1.6.0. So we're pretty much getting there guys, we're not too far behind the PC users, um, at least we now have a date which is good. And the last bit of news I wanted to bring you was an error that Dead by Daylight have apparently fixed that prevents us from entering the game on all platforms. So I did notice whenever I'm searching with a group of three or four uh, friends, trying to find a game is so much harder. You're waiting 20, 30, 40 minutes for one game and nine times out of 10, the killer will quit straight away and it's very frustrating. So hopefully this will address that issue and we can all get into games a lot faster. So there you have it guys, that's pretty much it from me. I hope you found this video insightful. Be sure to drop us a like on this video and comment and let me know what you think. I'm always interested in your thoughts. Let me know, do you think we'll be getting a DLC on the 21st and 25th or do you reckon for Europe we'll be a little bit later? And also the thoughts on all the information. Let me know in the comment box below. But yeah, that's pretty much it for me guys. So have a good day and I'll catch you guys next time.